ஒரு சாமானியனின் கனவு சொந்த வீடு வாங்குவது அருணிக்சலோ வழங்கும் உங்கள் வீடு எங்கள் சீரு வீடு மற்றும் வீட்டு மனைகள் வெறும் பத்தொன்பது லட்சத்தில் இருந்து நமஸ்கார் ரெஸ்பெக்டட் மீடியா பர்சன் ஃப்ரம் தேட் ஆஃப் தமிழ்நாடு அண்ட் ஆல்சோ ஃப்ரம் லைக் அண்டர் த டைனமிக் லீடர்ஷிப் ஆஃப் ஆனரபிள் பிரைம் மினிஸ்டர் நரேந்திர மோடிஜி யூ ஆல் நோ தட் வாட் ஆர் த எக்ஸாம்பிளரி ட்ரான்ஸ்பார்மேஷன் டேக்கிங் பிளேஸ் இன் த செக்டர் ஆஃப் நாட் ஓன்லி இன் கனெக்டிவிட்டி அண்ட் கம்யூனிகேஷன் பட் இன் ஆல் த எஸ்பெக்ட் த ஈகோ சிஸ்டம் to create an environment to make india one of the most powerful developed country in the world so you all know that how india was there about 10 years back our position was 11th in the world economy now because of the exemplary initiative and because of the dynamic leadership of honorable prime minister narendra modi ji india now become one of the you know top economy in the world positioning itself as fifth largest economy now in the next 5 years we want to become the 5 trillion economy in the next 5 years so that is why a lot of initiatives are being taken and in the 100 days of this new government under the leadership of honorable prime ministers you have seen what are the important initiative have been already put into the ground and ultimately helping india to grow faster and even in our sector also i want to cite out this a particular example tutikurin this is international container terminal it was supposed to be completed in the next year but it is completed well in advance so that reflects the quality of performance of this particular government at delhi and with the support of the people of this region we could able to complete it now the capacity of container handling will be 6 lakhs 6 lakhs tubes and in the next by 2035 and with the addition of this and with this 14.20 draft this particular terminal will have the container handling capacity up to 2.3 million tubes by 2035 if you add the other outer harbor then it will go up to 6.2 million tubes that will definitely give a special status in the global scenario to this particular port so that is why this is a very very encouraging moment for all of us and now as you know earlier because of the lack of the transshipment facilities our most of the cargo had been diverted to the east and west particularly the like an uh, kind of uh, international port where other, other ports so now because of that like an you know, lack of facilities we have to incur the burden of excess 100 dollars 100 dollars per tube now because of this particular state of art facility now the exporter will be competitive and they will be at profit and time will be safe so this tutikurin is known to be the all weather port which can run 24 into 7 for 365 days in a year so that is the power stand in this particular port that is why in the near future as you know india is going to become one of the leaders in the maritime threat as a maritime country so that is why all this ecosystem are being developed in the recent past you have seen honorable prime minister who he led the foundation 
of the construction of the all time biggest port at Badawan at the worth of rupees 76000 crores so i believe this is the way all the transportation is taking place in the country in this port like you know shipping and waterway sectors and i am confident the the the, the tutikorin port is going to be one of the most globally important port and going to be one of the half of the transshipment facilities so yeah. what would be, be cost saving for the exporter and importer uh, because of this terminal? Of course, I, I have said that it is 150, like you know, kind of you know, this thing uh, okay. dollars every containers. So okay. that is the way it would be cost effect, cost effective, cost effective, and it would be competitive also. Our exporter will be competitive globally, and we could also set the time. Otherwise, if you can ship the cargo from the like nearby international ports then definitely you take a lot of time and ultimately customers suffer customers okay. suffer so that is why to make congestion more also congestion also happen that's why we want to make more competitive and more like you know efficient this kind of facilities are being developed thank you Look, we have all port system because in the recent past we had a very very meaningful dialogue with all the like you know coastal states and Indian territories at Goa about two days back. In that particular event, we have discussed in details the coastal line that is seven thousand five hundred kilometer. Whatever ports are existed there, all the respective government. In collaboration with the central government, we will work together to improve our quality of functioning and also to modernize the zone of our port system and also incorporating latest technology to make it more.